Hello Internet, my name's Kevin King, founder of Plum Geek. I'm here today to introduce Ringo. Ringo is a palm-sized robot based on the Arduino Uno. He's perfect for any robotics enthusiast. The wide range of smarts and sensors we've included will challenge and entertain even the most advanced programmers, yet he's still a perfect fit for anyone taking their first steps into robotics or programming. Ringo ships with 10 interesting behaviors preloaded, so you can start having fun as soon as you open the box. You can activate and control the behaviors with the included remote control. The light chase. Here, Ringo uses the three light sensors to track and follow the light. The pretty glow is coming from the two lights on his underside. You could make these any colors you want. The line follow. Here he's using the edge sensors under his feelers to see the line. His eye flashes green when the sensor on that side sees the line. The finger nipper. Here he's using his accelerometer and determining which direction he's pushed from. Then he attacks in that direction. The scaredy bug. Similar example, but he runs the opposite direction when disturbed. In this example, the gyroscope is used to keep Ringo pointed a specific direction even when disturbed. Wind him up like a clock and let him go. He returns to the starting position. Pretty cool, huh? After you learn how his sensors work with the preloaded examples, you can customize them with your own personal touch by editing our easy to understand example code. This is a great way to learn the basic structure of how a program works and to move towards more advanced skills. You can make him come to life, like he has a real personality. He drives around using a pair of pager motors. The tips of the motors make contact with the surface on either side. Both motors can run in either direction and at variable speed. This makes him very maneuverable. Ringo can determine where he is, how he's moving, and where he's pointing thanks to an onboard accelerometer and gyroscope. He can be programmed to use these sensors to go in straight lines and to travel specific distances. This control loop can be made a bit sloppy on purpose, which results in a characteristic buggy swagger. No swag. A bit of swag. Lots of swag. It's as easy as changing a variable in your code. He can show you how he's feeling with six RGB LEDs. These are the same lights used in NeoPixel products from Adafruit. Each can be made to show any color you can think of, and they can be controlled individually. Ringo can see light from 360 degrees using three sensors. He can determine the direction of light and shadows. There's sensors under the feelers that can be used to follow a line, sense edges, and avoid jumping off your table. Thanks to an onboard TV remote control receiver, you can trigger and control behaviors with the remote or teach him to respond to just about any other TV remote. He has three infrared light sources pointed 120 degrees apart which can be used to communicate with other Ringo bots, appliances like your TV, or used together with the light sensors to sense objects or movement nearby. The easy-to-use communication features of Ringo make it possible to create behaviors where many robots interact. Look, they're playing tag! To give Ringo a voice, we've included a piezo sound element. It can be used to emit any variety of buggy chirps, zips, and pings you can think of. It can also be used to play musical notes. The robot is powered from a single rechargeable lithium battery. Because he'll eventually get tired and need a recharge, we've included a complete automatic charging system right on board. To get the code between your computer and the Ringo robot, you'll use our programming adapter. This programming adapter plugs into your computer's USB on one end and Ringo's programming port on the other. In addition to programming, the adapter provides power to charge up your Ringo without removing its battery. It also allows the use of the Arduino serial print functions to debug your bug. About a year ago, I taught my son how to write an Arduino program to control an RGB LED. I'll never forget the moment when he realized he could control the blink rate and the colors just by editing the code. He pushed me off the keyboard, then spent hours writing new blink sequences. This inspired my daughter, who asked me how to program a robot. This is where the idea for Ringo was born. The kids have been a part of the design process from the start, and they would love to share Ringo with the world. As our community grows, you'll be able to visit us online and interact with others. Learn tips and tricks to customize your own bot, then share your robot's personality with the group. We'll create a library of our favorites which can be downloaded and further personalized by others in the group. We've already written software that can be easily used as building blocks in creating your own behaviors. So what's next? I'm asking you to back this project so we can purchase parts and tooling for our first production run. Ringo is just the first of several robot designs we plan to release. If you help us make Ringo and Plum Geek a success, we hope to release a new design every few months. As we grow, we pledge to continue in the spirit of the open source movement to share and to freely educate. Thank you for your time, and thank you for your support.